everyone, Dan here with a fixed phone for your latest club ramblings. It's been great to see your comments on our latest club bottle, our very first completely independent bottling. Um, good and bad, uh, those who aren't so sure or aren't liking it at the moment, one thing I'd say about McMira is it's a brand that quite often evolves quite quickly from the first taste. It, those who were with us years ago, was it three years ago now, when we did McMira Skogs Halong, the uh, raspberry wine finished whiskey, uh, when I first tasted it, I wasn't actually sure if that would be right for us. Came back two weeks later and oh wow, that was delicious. So um, yeah, worry not, it should evolve and hopefully into something you do like. Um, the whiskey shots, Summit and Whiskey Shots competition is now open. Please can I ask as many of you take part as possible. It's one of the most important things we do to get brands interested in, in us. Uh, they see um, us sharing our images and um, they want to get involved. Uh, so please share, share your images and remember tag us in and use hashtag Summit and Whiskey Shots so you're in with a chance to win a dram but in truth you're in with a very, very high chance. The last few months, almost everyone who's entered has won. Uh, it's that kind of, I think, you're almost like a 50-50 chance. So um, you'll be rewarded for sharing that image as well. Um, and that goes through to uh, just a little bit of an insight. Our fourth oct planned October bottle um, has fallen through this last week. Uh, each for a very fair and good reason. Each was a delicious bottle. Uh, most I hope to come back to in the future um, as and when glass shortages, uh, one was an illness, um, those resolve but we will be using them later so what I'm doing at the moment is seeing what we can bring in in its place, can we bring December forward, I've got two or three brands that I've been trying to work with for a while seeing if we can get them involved uh, and each option we have for, uh, importantly is a different flavour profile from the last and the one before because for me that's important so if you weren't keen on one you know the next one's going to be so different that you're more than likely to like that one so that's what i'm working on at the moment um, and also just to keep everyone informed there's not going to be a virtual event this year uh, i've tried i know the virtual festival wasn't going to happen but i tried to see if i could create something a lot smaller i just can't get the brands involved um, I'll keep working on it. It's a format I think that we will be able to use at some point. So we'll see if we can get it in for next year instead. Um, a few people have been asking about our club glasses. Um, I will put them on in the club shop for the next week. So if you'd like a glass, please, um, it, they'll be on the shop from today for a few days. So uh, we can get them out for everyone. And in your next email you're going to see there's a link to a questionnaire um, please can you fill that out it I often ask you questions about it you know on on the club chat in discord so in the Facebook group as well um, to get a gauge as to what what where we are what people are liking but this is the first attempt to do a full-scale questionnaire going into depth in a number of different areas just for me to really understand what's important to you all and it helps me um, understand where we're going forward what's important to us at the moment I'm looking and planning next year so any uh, your input helps guide the club to be more like what you'd like um, so yeah, there's two bits of input I'm asking for. So the questionnaire when that comes out and sharing the photos. Both of those will make your club better. Um, anyway, it's nice to be back on the phone and being able to talk to you uh, uh, via video. Uh, have great whiskey and I'll catch up with you soon.